Hey, welcome to the Absolutely Improvised Monologue. You know the drill. Somewhere down here is a prompt. So I go to the uh, to the Aldi's for Gil. And uh, we're walking around. We got our masks on because, you know, you're supposed to be wearing masks today. The kids got their mask on. Uh, Gail, uh, Gail Jr. has a uh, lovely pink mask with little unicorns on it. Uh, Porky Jr. has a John Cena mask. I, I can't help the kid doesn't know any better. Anyway, so uh, we're walking around. We're getting our cucumbers and our uh, diet sodas. And we see this couple coming toward us. And uh, they ain't got no masks on. Now me, I got gold medals for minding my own damn business. Gail doesn't say a word. Porky Jr. walks up to the guy and he says, Hey, mister, I don't want to disrespect you, but where's your mask? And the guy says, Shut up, kid. So that's when I... Uh, dip into my, yeah, I'm not my, all my own business. I said, who, who are you talking to? She said, you're a kid. I said, you don't disrespect my kid. Do not, I will, I, you will lose the rest of the day if you disrespect my kid. He said, your kid disrespected me. I said, first of all, he's a kid. Second of all, he didn't. He actually said not to disrespect you. But he's right. Why aren't you wearing a mask? And the woman says, well, we're just shopping. We don't need a mask. So look at me, I'm just shopping, I got a mask, my wife got a mask, my kids got masks, you need a mask. And the guy says, well, I got my rights. I said, I have my rights too, and my rights include living. My rights include my family living. Your rights don't infringe on that. Your rights aren't better than my rights, your rights aren't bigger than my rights. Go get your damn mask. He says, what are you going to do about it? I pulled the mask down just for him to realize who he was talking to. And he looked at his wife or girlfriend, or whatever. He said, um, we should go get our masks on. And she says, who's he? And the guy says, he's someone in his neighborhood who, when he tells you to do something, you do it. She says, well, I don't want to do it. So Gail pulls her mask down just enough. She pulls it back up. And the woman said, honey, let's go get our masks. And then maybe we'll shop at Tony's after this. I said, that's a good idea. Hit the streets. Beat the streets with your feet, because it's sweet. 